How's it going everybody? This is Cartanetix Coding and today I'm going to show you how to create the most motion application in Java. Most motion application in Java is basically an application that tracks the motion of the mouse. Um, you can create um, drawings by tracking the most motion like that and let's just see how the code uh, runs okay let's just let's just create the code let's create Java project let's name it <coughs> most motion finish and then the same and we we'll create the class the same name mouse motion nope mouse motion <clears throat> okay there we go now first of all we're going to extend mouse motion adapter class extend mouse Wait. Stands mouse motion adapter. There you go. Then we'll import the mouse motion adapter. To that <coughs> create the J frame F. And then we'll create the constructor mouse motion. Let's import the A-frame. There we go. You can create this by using J-frame or just frame. You know, there's just two separate things. There is one that is called J-frame and there is one that is called frame. You can either use both of this. Okay. So for today's video, I'm going to use the J-frame. Now, inside the constructor, first we'll create the J-frame. If we close a new J-frame. Mouse motion adapter. And then F dot add mouse motion add mouse motion listener this into this frame. Right, you understand that? Set size four hundred by Four hundred by four hundred. Left dot set layout. No visible true. Left dot set default separation. A frame dot exit and close. Now <coughs> we basically have created the J frame. Let's now create the main method. Public static. I missed. I missed type this. There we go. <coughs> Let's now call the constructor new new mouse motion. Let's just first run the code and see does the J frame works. There we go. The J frame works just fine. Now we can close this. There you go. It automatically closes and terminate the program. Now, what do we have to do next? Okay, next we'll create a graphics. Uh, no, no, it's we create a mouse drag. Uh, <coughs> we'll create a mouse drag method. Okay. Public void mouse drag mouse event. 
E. Now, inside this mouse drag, we're going to create uh, the graphics that will create whatever drawing we need to draw inside the JFrame. Right, first, in order to create drawings, we need to do graphics G equals uh, that get graphics. And then G dot set color color dot orange G dot fill oval uh, E dot get X Y dot get no, no, E dot get Y with the width of twenty by twenty. Like that okay um yes <laughs> let's import the most event basically now here we are all done uh why do I set set color first because if we if I set the field over first it will not be colored at all because the way Java read code is from the top to bottom. So first it will read this, first it will read this, and it will read the set color, and then it will read the fill oval. It will color what it will color whatever runs down underneath the set color, which is the fill oval. That's it. It's just simple logic. Now we just need to run the code. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Let's see. First, we need to click, and then we drag like this. Yeah. It's just like it's just the same as the mouse listener application that I've created before, the one that with the blue circle. But the difference is, it it can only create circles by clicking it, and it will only create one circle. But in this, but in this, um, but in this application. <coughs> we need to drag and by dragging we create multiple circles like this let's create a new one let's create java there you go we can also create this by fill rectangle you just need to change this to fill rect and it will just be the same. There we go. It's a rectangle now. And maybe I need to um, change the color to black. Whatever it is, it will work. Ta -da. There you go. And I guess uh, that's it for today's video. I hope you understand and you can do it on your own and until then, happy coding.